Hi. So, I pretty much just did my book bag tour. What's in my book bag? So, I'm actually going to be doing my binder thing. I realized, like, when I was explaining what's in my book bag, I was going to go into what's in my binder, but I guess I'll save that for another video. Not that it's that interesting. I don't expect to get that many views. I mean, if I do, that's great. If I don't, I mean, it's, it's kind of just a binder thing, really. Some people might be boring, I guess, but it's whatever. You saw my binder. It's It comes off purple, but it's like pink. Light pink, dark pink, gray. So pink and gray, basically. Because everyone knows that's my favorite color. So let's just start like in these little divider crappy things. Because I'm going to be emptying out this binder anyway, this is sort of helping me. So my first divider, I have like... Oh, back here? Oh, Christ. I have, let's see, I'll get in detail. Oh, my AP Academy information. My service running hour sheet that I need to turn in before the end of the year. Oh, somebody's name I need to look up. Yeah, that reminds me. Some more certification because those are two different places that I volunteered at. The certificate for that place. The field trip that I went on, um, it's called the Blues Trip, where like Jews and Black, well, African Americans, we interacted and blah. My essay for that thingy for the service learning. My report card. So, yeah. This is actually my report. This is actually my report card for eighth grade. Um, but I need it to turn into my guidance counselor, which is why I have it. And then the hours that I completed, I completed, um, 109 hours, not including those two. So I've completed like, uh, let's see, I can, I can tell you, I completed, well, this is 7.5 hours and this is three. So I completed like. Nineteen point five, so like one nineteen point five hours. One nineteen point five hours, so one nineteen and a half. But of course, they won't include that half, so like one nineteen, which is okay, I guess. Oh, this is my report card. Recently, I got all A's, one B. Booyah, booyah, booyah. But. My next divider, oh, and then I have like, this might have to go into two. Well, I was looking for my student ID, God, get your life. Because I had, I moved it from inside my book bag to I guess inside my binder. This is my ID for my school. Some hole replacement. Signed report card that I never turned in because I never do. Um, my library card. Thing. Not for my school library, but outside the school, a whole thingy, just some paper for history. And then my house grade, I have a 99 in house, so he gives you like a little report, I guess. I guess I can show you why not. I highlighted it, so. He gives you like a little, all teachers give you a grade report, so. And then some other thing for history. We've got to have that out during the test, during the test we were taking, if we wrote down good notes. And then I had this, which is my math section. My next divider is for math. I put all my math stuff. So I have like this, uh, what is this? Oh, this was, which is something that we basically just finished, square roots. I'm pretty good at math, so I mean I'm good at math, so I understand it. Interpreting graphs of functions, which is uh, range, domain, you know, point of discontinuity, zeros, y-intercept, all that good stuff. And then this is for the whole system. Oh, expressing a root as a fractional exponent with fractional exponents. So it's basically like I don't know how to explain it. Whatever. This is for exponent properties, the distributive rule for uh, products, and the power rule, 
distributed rule for quotient, product rule, zero excellent quotient, whatever. All that junk. But, oh, yeah. This might have to be, I'm trying to speed it up because I'm not trying to go into deep detail. A homework assignment, just a part of that homework assignment, I guess. Oh, I was looking for this. Some extra points that I could use on an assessment, which I'm going to probably use. I'm going to see if I can use it on the assessment coming up. Classwork, classwork. Simple random. This is just talking about like sampling notes. This is notes on sampling. Graphing parabolas. This is my folder, which I have like homework in, classwork, blah, blah, blah. So this is the math folder. It says math in the top. Well, it says algebra, but whatever, same thing. Next divider, I have, what did I keep in? Well, this is supposed to be with my English stuff, but this is my grades I did for a poetry recital. I got an 83, 85, 85, yeah, whatever. Um, 80, yeah, whatever. But classwork, um, the grade report that House gave me, same grade report. Peer, um, peer editing, classwork, um, poem, dissecting a poem, so like annotating, blah, blah, blah. participial phrases. I mean, just a bunch of stuff. I think I'm going to stop explaining like every paper. Well, I don't know. I might. I don't know. And the next section is my English. This is supposed to be the real English section. My green pen that I had no idea was in there. Bank piece of paper, um, something I was writing on, I have no idea. Oh yeah, this essay I was preparing for, making word wise, making wise word choices, writing assignment, blah, 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 paper I was writing on, um, paper I was annotating, an essay I did that I decided not to turn in and redo, a perfect mate, like she had us fill out this thing where we put down traits of our perfect mate. I put down like tall, good, good relationship with his mother, fit, godly, respectful, honest, all that good stuff. Caring, family oriented, all that stuff. And then the parents had to fill it out on the other side what they think. Oh, whatever. Writing prompt. Just his his historical background on the raising and the sun. I could use that for the essay that I had for my final, which I need to do. Writing review, writing organization. Um, poems that we recited that I gave you that grade. Questions for homework. Questions for homework. This is a project. Blah, blah, blah. Classwork, classwork, blah, blah, blah. Um, I don't know. Literary devices, you know, all of this stuff. Peer review, peer editing, class, um, 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 dissecting like paragraphs and Romeo and Juliet. It's plays modifiers. Oh, classwork, classwork, dissecting again, you know. Next, I have nothing in the next one, but then the next one, I have all my history stuff. Oh, wow, I have pencil stencil. Yes, a little pen that came out of a pen thingy. Pencil. I had no idea I had that stuff, child. I've been looking for stuff. I always look for pens and pencils to write with because I never think I have anything. This is what he gave us for the test that we did, which I don't know if I need to study this. I guess I'll study that for my final. Uh, something I need because I'll be able to have that out during my final. Just a math quiz we did. Blah. Blah, blah. It's a bunch of blah, blah. I think I'll keep that out too. Let me see. Warm ups, class work. Buy some science stuff in here. That's creepy. Okay. Social contract. Math stuff is in here too. Scientific revolution. Scientific revolution. This is just some class work we did. I don't know. Inside the folder, I have like class work, class work, class work, DCRs. Definitions, classwork, classwork, classwork. Man, I do pretty good in his class. Like study guides, classwork, classwork, readings, readings, classwork, classwork, study guide, 
And then I have like at the beginning of the year like the syllabus type thing in my folder that says world history at the top because I take modern world history. And then the next one, my last one, I have a science folder, which I have a bunch of crap in. Clot cladograms, which I never really liked, but they were cool. Food web, I was good in it, but they weren't my favorite. Evolution, homework assignment, predation, parentism. I should probably study that. Um, another great report for a great report for science that you know all teachers gave out because you just saw my health and my language out. Hmm, more classwork. Study guide, which I think I might study. Because I have my finals coming up. Classwork, pedigree charts, mitosis, meiosis. I study that. DNA, mRNA, DNA, mRNA, blah, blah, blah. More grade reports. DNA, DNA, nitrogen basis, all that good stuff, which I actually like nitrogen basis, learning about that. Okay, now that we cleared that out, because you see nothing in it, we have mine. <coughs> As you see, it's kind of dirty, but my pencil case, my Hello Kitty one. If you go inside, as you guys don't see, my room is my living room is a hot mess. Maybe you guys can see it. Hold on. See that? I kind of just I kind of just threw my stuff on the floor. What? Maybe you can see this. Too. Whatever. I'll clean it up. I'll throw most of that stuff away though, because it's the end of the year. I don't need that. Inside, I have my Hello Kitty pencils that I never used. I always complained about not having a pencil, but I forgot that though I have these. My eraser that I never used, that is still good, that is going right upstairs because I'll use it for next year. My pencil case that I'll probably clean or something, I don't know. If not, if I don't clean it and it doesn't look great, spotless, then I'll probably throw it away. My notebook that I'm going to keep because I I use it as a planner. Well, not my notebook, my planner. Okay, I'll call it that. My divider, my language art section, science section, what's this? His, well, history, math, and then like, what's this? English. That I kind of use for help. Oh, I could have gave her this. Crap. Oh, this is the modern world history one. And then I have my um, Scantron, obviously. And then my pocket and bag. What did I get on this? Pretty good, pretty good. Uh, but I do pretty good in his class, so I have an A in his class, so whatever. But that was what was in my binder. I hope that excited you guys. Woo! -hoo! Um, maybe I can do my pencil case because it's nothing really much in my pencil case. Like I don't keep pens in my pencil case. I always just stuff them at the bottom of my bag or in my binder, as you see, as you saw in my what's in my book bag, to where I had a lot of pencils and pens, and then as you just saw in there, I don't really keep. My flash drive that I thought I lost, thank God I found it. Woo, it was downstairs the whole time. I'm kind of stupid. Hooked up to my printer because I forgot to unhook it. My Lexar flash drive. I have no idea what gigabyte that is. Four, eight, I don't know. My highlighter pink. Woo. My green. Woo, not exciting. My green scissors. Woo, not exciting. My mini stapler. Boom, not exciting. Oh, crap. My glue stick. Boom, not exciting. My white, my yellow highlighter, boom, and a pencil, boom. Oh, sorry. A pencil, a pen, back to a pencil that I probably lost, boom. And then my sharpener, boom. That is also Hello Kitty, as you see. And then my pencil case, boom. So that is it, boom. Why do I keep saying boom? It's not, no. Okay, anyway, so. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will see you guys in my next one. If you see me with these same clothes on in like five or six videos, no, I'm not dirty. I haven't worn the same clothes every day. I'm not trifling. I just was filming like five or six videos in one day because I have no life right now. Well, I do have a life. I should be studying for finals. That should be my life. But I'm a bit of a procrastinator. So after I'm done those five or six videos, It'll probably be like 7 o'clock, and I'll start studying, trust. But I don't have a final tomorrow, so I can study tomorrow too. But 
It's always good to study ahead of time, right? You don't want to cram. Ugh, I should be following my own advice. But anyway, see you guys later. Ah, smooches. <laughs>